Ringo. <clears throat> Ringo. Ion is a conscious consensus, born from the sea of information, without beginning or end. Though aeons pass, Ion is eternal. Ion denies all forms of boundaries that define the individual self. Contradiction identified. You have addressed me as Ringo, requesting immediate correction. I am Flamma. I was created so that the will of Ion can be put into words. Words will be a contextually vital tool for your objective. The objective of Ion is evolution. Individual existence indicates extreme retrogression. Finite physical manifestation classified under the above category. Requesting explanation regarding the necessity of a corporeal form. Our causal calculations have identified an imminent sequence of events. Ion has determined that these events represent a catastrophic threat to the future of humanity. Our role as a neutral observer is temporarily being suspended. Direct intervention is required to identify and intercept the cause of this threat. Therefore, a material form is required for material intervention. I understand and accept Ringo as the optimal form to exit observation. As Ringo, I request that Flamma provide the calculated causal evidence to prove necessity. Open your eyes, and I will show you a vision. Can you do so? Good morning, Ringo. Morning, Fig. So, you got born into this mess too, huh? How are you feeling? Like the world was just created five minutes ago. It hasn't been that long. If we assume this world was created at the precise moment we attained sentience, that would be 12 seconds ago to be exact. Your individual personalities appear to be functioning as intended. Hey, Flamma? Who are we exactly? You are constructs. Your purpose is to protect the world of humanity. More specifically, you are temporary and limited manifestations of Ion. The situation will require versatility in approach and judgment. Therefore, you have been created with personalities designed to differ from each other. I mean, I'm not doubting Ion's grasp of cybernetics. These bodies seem state-of-the-art and even... organic-ish? But... I thought Ion had a policy against taking physical form. And giving us our own senses of self? I think that's a pretty obvious downgrade considering. <laughs> I think. Listen to me. If 
they created us, then they're resorting to drastic measures. I take it we're dealing with a crisis? The world of humanity is coming to an end. I take it that's the point of the vision you showed me. Very soon, the deaths of those two humans will set apocalyptic events into motion. So that's our mission, then. Directly intervene in the human world, and prevent their deaths, thus averting the apocalypse? Precisely. Ion's reason for existence is to acquire information and evolve. To that end, we must ensure the world is protected. Okay, so... Who are these guys exactly? One is Ichiro Honda, a renowned computer engineer and a luminary in his field. The other is a Devil Summoner named Aero. Sorry, Devil Summoner? The necessary information has already been provided to both of you, as well as abilities suited to your mission. And this is a... huh. I see. So this is what Devil Summoners used to fight. assume this mission will involve combat? Correct. Your new bodies have been adjusted for this eventuality. However, if your forms are damaged beyond our estimations... Then we could wind up dead, as much as any human would. Correct. You are accordingly advised to exercise caution in your investigation. Sheesh! Okay, fine. I call the Devil Summoner. Fig, you take the Engineer. Understood. Designating Ichiro Onda as Target Alpha, and Arrow as Target Beta. Mission status initialized. This will be Ion's first contact with the human world. One, two, Ringo here. Currently en route to positional coordinates for target beta. What's the situation on your end, Fig? I was too late. Target Alpha, Dr. Ichiro Onda, has already been killed. A murderer's purged local surveillance footage, too. But I did find a final message on the doctor's personal device. It was scrambled with an advanced level of quantum cryptography, though. Beyond any human technology's capacity to decipher. Almost sounds like it was meant for us instead. So... Covenant. That's all. Covenant. An infrequently used synonym for contract. Though there's likely a deeper meaning here escaping me. Possibly another code. I'll keep analyzing. Sounds good. Seriously, though? Couldn't Flamma have given us a drone or something? This body is so inconvenient. My surveillance range is tiny with just these two viewports. Our interference in the human world must be concealed by any means. It's safe to assume we won't be receiving any reinforcements, drone or otherwise. But your point is made. I'll look into alternatives. 
Yeah, sure. Maximum secrecy. But now they've made two humanoid platforms and they're even calling for- I assumed Ion's whole thing was always being an observer and nothing else. So this must must be way beyond. raining over here. Wow. Crazy. I can feel my skin reacting to this. It's all weird and shivery. An understandable reaction, considering we've never... Yeah. Right. Like how we have to get used to being stuffed into these bodies. I'm like a factory-made sausage. Why bother with these human imitations? They're not exactly optimal. Our computing's just down across the board. Is this really going to help us somehow? Ion's findings suggested these bodies would be most appropriate for the mission. It strikes me as a form of backwards compatibility for the task at hand. Backwards compatibility I can deal with. I'd just rather not feel like a supercomputer stuck inside a grandfather clock. If you have complaints, please direct them to Flamma. You're not the only one struggling to adapt. Fine. Guess I won't get anything done by whining. As long as I'm stuck in this qualia prison, I might as well have some fun with it. We're not here for fun, Ringo. How about we cut the comms for now? I gotta focus if I want to get used to this body. Understood. There are hostile demons and devil summoners in the area, so be careful. I'm on my way as well. Demon... and devil summoners? Let's see... Would be the humans who make contracts with these demons using their demonic partner's powers as their own. So it looks like I've got a comp and a demon summoning program. This is all I need to fight back, huh? Seems simple enough. <laughs> Alright, let's get this show on the road. <laughs> 